Hey guys and welcome to my online Photoshop tutorials. Very quickly and very simply how to remove any object from a photo. Three different techniques. So the first technique is the patch tool. So if you go over to the left go to your patch button just here and click on the patch tool. Now we're going to try and remove the dog and the man from the photo. I'm sure he's a nice guy but we just want to focus on our landscape for this. So if you just circle around what you want to remove, so we start with the dog, so just draw around the dog, like so, and then click and hold and drag across, and what this would do is to copy a similar piece of graphic which is close by. So if we just turn it off and have a look, it's pretty good, pretty, it works pretty well. Um, let's just try the patch tool over the guy. So again, draw around him, draw around his reflection as well, because we don't really want that as well. Like so, drag across. Uh, as you can see, obviously, it's, it's adapting to um, what we're dragging to. Try and join that up, kind of, maybe about there. Uh, and there you go, it's basically removed it using the patch tool. That's pretty pretty quick and simple way to try. So if we go to um, go to your left and go to your one of your lasso tools, um, I'm just going to use lasso from here. Um, again, select the dog, like so. And then if you click Shift and Delete on the Mac, this will bring up your fill um, options and make sure that on your contents, you've got it content aware, there's other different options, but we want it content aware, 100%, this is all fine, click OK, and it removes it itself, and what it basically does is, the computer is trying to work out if that object wasn't there, what might be in the background, it's quite a clever way of doing it, so let's just try the lasso over the man, again, go over his reflection, like so, shift delete, make sure you're content aware, click OK, and there you go. You can see there's a little bit of a bump just behind, um, and there's a few little joining issues as well. Um, and then the last way is probably the most manual way of doing something like this. So if you've got the dog and the walker, um, if we go to the clone tool, which is probably a common one that most people know, make sure you've got it quite small, like so, I'm just going to keep it 100% for now, uh, so you just hold all and just click where you want to copy from, so I'm going to copy this this piece just next to the dog, go towards the dog and as you can see, if I start clicking, it will automatically copy from what's next to the dog and remove it. Um, and obviously the further you, you go across it will start to recreate the dog again which we don't want um, and you can just do this anywhere so where I've got a bit of reflection there that I want removing just go to next to it hold, oh, click go over to it and run your brush across and it removes it there you go, it's a very quick, very simple way to remove objects from photos obviously it doesn't have to be a man and his dog, bless him it could be anyone you want, it could be books, cars trees, you name it, but these three techniques are quite easy, quite simple, and they should get the job done for you. Hope you enjoy, um, catch you next time guys, have a good day.